What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel here, Crypto Nation. This is going to be a quick video. Try to keep it within like seven to eight minutes. Uh, I'm just going to talk about the crypto market, what's going on, how this recent war over in the Middle East between Israel and whatever, Hamas, Palestine, how is this going to affect Bitcoin in the crypto market? Um, I don't know. Uh, it could it could affect the crypto market. Maybe. I don't know what the historical value. I mean, the historical um, history is as far as uh, this war in the Middle East affecting the crypto market. You know, we know that Bitcoin and crypto has been around for what since what, uh, what, 11, 12 years since like what, 2008, nine. And most altcoins then come until like after Bitcoin with the total. What was it? 2009 or whatever. Ten is what really when a lot of, you know, all coins start coming into the scene or even later because uh, I still remember back in 2000 what 17 18 coinbase only had like maybe one one or two all coins like literally <laughs> but now coinbase has like I don't know maybe up to like 200 different all coins who knows they have a lot of them. uh but anyways um what's going on here uh yeah we're gonna see how how this recent war affects the market um you know, some altcoins are down a little bit. We did see a little, um, a small, um, how can I say it? Altcoins got hit a little bit overnight, somewhat. Uh, but, you know, mostly the altcoins are, you know, they're trading sideways, most of them. So, you know, we we, we haven't seen a major pump in a while. But we're hopefully, hopefully this month we can see a major, you know, altcoin uh, pump. Um but yeah, it'll you know it can only get better. But I don't know what the um as far as these you know war in the Middle East or whatever. I don't know what as far as the historical um data is concerned how it really affects. But anyways, maybe you know you can comment below. Maybe you know uh, more you know you know more than I do. Uh, but anyways, you know this crypto market is uh you know we'll see what what happens. How you know I guess we'll see how it responds. To this recent war with Israel, with Israel and Hamas over in Palestine. Uh, but anyways, because I'm not going to go into the politics of it or whatever. But you know, but we we know what's going on over there. They've been they've been going at it for even before crypto was even thought of. <laughs> you know, they've been going at it even before crypto was thought of. So yeah, I don't. Or maybe it doesn't affect the crypto market at all. Crypto crypto is just moving on its own on its own uh, terms. Uh, but yeah. Alrighty. Then we got a little bit of crypto news. What does it say here? Google Cloud joins Polygon versus validator stakes over 10,000 Matic. Alrighty. Uh, Axie Xfinity isn't dead. How Sky Mavericks chair plans to survive, revive former Web3 darling. You know, just a little bit of crypto news. Crypto news. Uh, Robert F. Kennedy Jr. interview, Bitcoin, CBDCs, and the war on freedom. Yeah, one thing about um, Robert F. Kennedy Jr., he is pro-crypto. That's one thing I like about him. I remember I saw his speech when he was at the Bitcoin convention, like months back. He is pro-crypto. So, you know, that's one thing I do like about him. Other than that, I don't know what his other views on other things, uh, you know, as far as like, you know, gun rights or whatever. But he is pro. He is pro-Bitcoin and crypto. Uh you know, that's that's what he says, you know, so I, I take I take his word for it. Then it says um, as of October 6, um, Bitcoin enters quiet bull market as safe haven from bond market turmoil. Turmoil analyst says. Bitcoin is set to thrive in October. Well, we're still in the beginning of October. Today's the 8th, so we'll see. All, I, all we know, Bitcoin can pump can pump next week. All we know, you know, we'll we'll see what happens. We will definitely de we'll definitely see what happens. Alrighty, it says first mover America's Ether ETF struggled to gain traction this first week. Uh, yeah, guys, uh, we're gonna see what happens here. Uh, that's the latest news. Bitcoin is still at about over twenty seven thousand. It's right under 28K. It, has, it looked like it hasn't hit 28K over the last, whatever, 24 to 48 hours. But it looked like, I, I have a feeling Bitcoin is going to hit uh, 28K either by tonight or tomorrow. 
we could possibly hit 28k again but like i said we need a we want to see bitcoin back at 30k people i don't know for some reason people's talking about a, a black another black swan event that's going to send bitcoin back below 20k but we'll see i don't know there people still believe that bitcoin is 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 people still believe that we're going to see another crash but me me uh, my opinion I, I don't believe we are i believe that the major crash that we had is already over with you know bitcoin all the way already went down to what 15k so I believe the most of the major crashes is I think that's already probably pretty much over and done with. I honestly don't see Bitcoin going back below. Um, I really don't see it going back below 25K. That's just what I believe. You know, unless if there's some type of weird black swan event, then yeah. But other than that, unless, there, unless, if, there's not a, if, unless if there's a black swan event, I don't see Bitcoin going, going down that low. But anyways, yeah. Unchained is now helping customers custody over two billion in Bitcoin. Okay. All right, a lot of news, a lot of stuff going on in the crypto market. But anyways, that's just a quick update, guys, of what's going on. Little little crypto news and what's going on with this recent war. Anyways, this is mainly just going to be a quick, you know, video with a little, you know, market update. Um. Anyways, uh, yeah, if you're new here, please, I just want to say if you're new here, please go ahead and subscribe and hit the like button uh, because it's totally free. And also, if, you, if you're a new subscriber, if you recently subscribed to my channel over the last like week, please go back and check to see if you're subscribed because I don't know, something happened where a lot of my um, new subscribers dumped off. I don't know what happened. Uh, but anyways, yeah, if you're new here, if you like the content, just go ahead and subscribe. And thank everybody. Please, and please hit the like button. It'll it at least help out the algorithm. You know, the more like likes I get. But anyways, uh, everybody help, help. Hope everybody have a good Sunday. I'm getting ready to head out to the gym. I'm, I'm going to try to make another video when I get back from the gym. And that's going to be in about a about few hours from now. Yeah, that's going to be several hours from now. Probably around. I'm looking at probably around 4 p.m. my time. 4 p.m. West Coast time is probably when I'll be able to between four. To, I'll say between four to five o'clock p.m. Western time. Pacific time is when I'll probably make another video. Uh, but anyways, hey, I'm going to get out of here. Yeah, everybody take care. Um, have a good Sunday. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care.